Hey there, everybody. How's, how's it going today? Ian back here with the Entertainment Examiner. Hey, it's been a while since I've, I've had a video. I'm going to try and get a few out for you. Just been busy with work and life and stuff. So um, I realized that, th that this year of 2021 is the 40th anniversary of one of my all-time favorite films, uh, Raiders of the Lost Ark. I have it in this Indiana Jones box set here. Uh, they just released all the in Indiana Jones films on um, 4K and Steelbooks, which I, I I know Best Buy has those, so maybe t take a look there. But I'll, I'll be talking about the first one, which is just titled Ra Raiders of the Lost Ark, but they keep titling it Indiana Jones and the Raiders of the Lost Ark. Um, this has all four films. Uh, this is, of course, uh, dire uh, directed by Steven Spielberg. It uh, came out in 1981, story by George Lucas. They were both um, vacationing in Hawaii, I believe, awaiting their releases of Star Wars and Close Encounters of the Third Kind. So this would have been 1977. And um, they both came up with this movie idea based on the kind of Saturday, um, the uh, Saturday morning, uh, the uh, uh, serials that were on back then. Um, and they came up with this idea of in of the uh, of Indiana Jones character. And um, sorry, my cat is wanting to visit a lot today. Um, and the Raiders of the Lost Ark uh, came to life. We have, of course, Harrison Ford as Indiana Jones, who which the role was originally supposed to be Tom Selleck, but he was still doing Magnum P.I., I know that Lucas has said he wasn't keen on originally having Harrison Ford because he'd already been Star Wars and American Graffiti. He didn't want a Scorsese, uh, De Niro situation going on. So, um, but this is just, it's, it's such a great movie from start to finish. You have great characters, um, great actors. We have, uh, Karen Allen as the female lead in the film, um, Sorry, my cat's apparently going to keep making appearances uh, throughout the video. Uh, Karen Allen in the film. Um, yeah, we, we the famous uh, snake scene, the famous uh, fist fight in front in front of the Nazi plane down here, and you know one of the most I think for a comic relief standpoint uh, where Indy shoots the guy that wants to to do a sword fight with him. It's still a really funny sequence because apparently Harrison Ford was very sick on the set at the time. Um, we also have uh, John, John Reese davies in this and uh, it's just it's such a great movie. Um, it's iconic from that opening scene where him and Alfred uh, Molina go in to you know get the idol and um, you know everything bad that could happen to them does from the spiders to the spikes to the big rolling ball. And the movie just keeps on going from there. We discover that uh, Dr. Jones is an archaeologist and a professor and wants to find the um, Ark of the Covenant and has to try to steal it back away from, from the Nazis. This, of course, takes place during Nazi Germany and World War II. And it's, it's a great setting, sequence. Spielberg nails all these action sequences. You know, um, I, there's not much else you can see about Raiders of the Lost Ark. That probably hasn't been said already, but I truly, truly love this movie. Um, I'm a fan of the series as a whole. I don't like the fourth one, The Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. I really hope that Indiana Jones 5, which is coming out, I don't know, with, within in the next year, I guess Harrison Ford just got a shoulder injury. He, he just turned 79 today, so. But, I mean, you know, if, if he thinks he can do it and it's turned out to be a good movie, I, I'm all for it. Um... The, the second one, uh, Temple of Doom, I like but not love. But I do love Last Crusade with Sean Connery as Indy's father. I think that's a great movie. So, um, yeah, if you've never seen any of the Indiana Jones films, uh, this, this is a really good box set that I, I have here. It has all four films in it. Last Crusade. Tries to find the Holy Grail and then the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. It's the last one that came out. So, um, and then they have the whole disc of bonus material too, which I don't know what the 4K 
has on it in terms of the steel books. It's it's a really cool box set though if you're uh, interested in buying that. This is an older release now. This is a a few years old. This complete adventures set. I'm not sure when this came out. Uh, to 2012. So this is quite old now, but it's still a great uh, uh, Blu-ray set if you just want a nice compact set for all the movies. And uh, happy 40 to, to Raiders of the Lost Ark. Still one of the great adventure movies. We are introduced to Indiana Jones, Spielberg, Lucas. Great cast. Gr gr some awesome adventure scenes. Um, wow, I still love this movie. It still holds up so, so well. So let me know down in the comments what your guys' favorite any uh, Indiana Jones film is. Do you like Raiders, Temple of Doom, Last Crusade, Crystal Skull? Uh, let me know what you guys like, and um, I really hope to hear from you. So uh, that's all I got for this kind of classic mo movie review for you guys. Uh, like, comment, subscribe to my page, Entertainment Examiner, and leave me a comment. So um, I, I will try my best to uh, uh, respond to you and let me know what your favorite Indiana Jones film is. So, um, okay, that's all I got for this video. And thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.